recently, I just heard this story. Uh, I won't say where it was, but there was a high level warlock that came into a church and, um, and, and he was uh, dividing, it, bringing division to the church or trying to divide the church uh, by his curses and his spells. And so the church recognized who this was in the spirit. So they surrounded him week by week. He came, but they surrounded him with worshipers. And, and finally, this man, this warlock, high level warlock broke. And he, he came to the leaders of this church and, and said, said, I, 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 gotta, I can't divide your church. No other church has resisted me this way. I've divided all the churches I've gone to, but I can't with this one. I don't understand why I can't. And he says, I'm just broken. And he was ready to give his, his life to the Lord. But, but literally he says, I, if I give my life to Jesus, I will be killed. Well, what happened was they prayed for him. And as they're praying, demons manifested and out of his mouth, a demonic spirit, high level spirit speaks, uh, uh, speaks out and it says, you people, you, the church, you people are so stupid. You don't know the power of the blood. It's interesting to me that the demonic power recognize the demonic realm recognizes the power of the blood. When the church has it, there's coming a discovery of the power of the blood for spiritual warfare in cities, in homes, in in in, in the nation. The, by the blood we overcome the accuser of the brethren. It's not just accusation, it's spirit realm. Acute accusations, high level demonic powers. And I'm just praying that God would give to us a spirit of wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of God in communion. Remember Dutch Sheet's dream, the dream given in January 2nd. I bring it back again. He saw this box, written on it was communion. And in the dream, there was a bat in that box and it said Ephesians 1.17, Ephesians 1.17. I'll give you a spirit of wisdom and revelation. And in the dream, this bat was to be used to strike Baal on the throat and, and, and defeat Baal. And Dutch said this. He said, when Jesus said when he, uh, concerning communion, as often as you do this, you proclaim my death, my blood until I come. In other words, in communion, in the power of the blood, we proclaim the victory of the blood, the victory of Christ over the principalities and powers. Brothers and sisters, it's time to take our mouths and declare the power of the blood over our circumstances, our families, over the powers of witchcraft and the insurgence of Baal worship into this nation. I say it's time for a revelation on communion and its power. Shall we, shall we enter into this Holy experiment of faith. Take communion. Give us a revelation, Lord. And then use the word of our mouths, that bat, and proclaim the victory of the blood.